Hello everybody, and welcome back to Neverwinter Nights, the core campaign. I'm Josh, this is Keygro, and Dalen, and today we are going to finish up the Troll Caves and proceed uh, further in. Right, so I'm getting right into it. And the first thing we have to do is take care of these ogres and some troll shamans. Okay. So Daewon has helped out tremendously by taking care of two of the trolls and now we can or two of the ogres and now we can deal with these shamans. He is hitting the troll from the ground. So I'm going to get behind it and start wailing on it from the other side. Alright, that's one shaman down, and now we can deal with the two trolls. Uh, there's a little graphical glitch here. As you can see, Daylin is fighting one of the trolls, but we can't see it. Probably because my vision would be obscured by this rock. Okay, now I've got two trolls on me. And now it's Taste down to my one. Savage fury. I need to... Defense up a bit so I don't die and take a potion. Alright, Dalen has finished off his troll and it looks like he's coming this way to help out. And as you could probably tell, this would have been a tremendously difficult fight for me uh, on my own. Just dealing with all the ogres and then the trolls. Alright, and we have a ghast here. And ghasts are little bit more powerful ghouls and if you notice the cloud they had they have the ability to uh, basically stun you with their stink and I think there's a couple more in here so but moving on didn't look like there was any treasure in that room there and the first branch we come to I'll take it and yep Couple more ghasts, or one more ghast, I guess. There's a trap chest over that way. Right, let's see what's this way first. A bit of treasure. Need some gold. Alright. So, this chest is obviously trapped, as you can see, the scorch marks on the ground. I just have to wait until I recognize it, and I will try to disarm it. Okay, since success is not possible, and my uh, disabled device isn't high enough, I'm going to go ahead and just acid arrow it. Okay, and that took care of it, and we'll take whatever remains, and Cloak of Elmenkind, pretty cool. Uh, probably not going to switch out my mini starred cloak for now, especially since I'm not trying to sneak anywhere, and that's all the cloak really does is help you hide. Alright, hey, so troll, me victory. the regular troll. Yeah. After you defeat the trolls, huh? there's this prisoner. Oh, don't eat me, please. Uh, calm down. I'm not going to eat you. You, 
You aren't a troll, are you? No, I'm not a troll. Then please help me. I need to get out of here. They're coming to kill me and eat me. I can hear them. I can hear them coming. Can't you hear them? Can't you hear the screams? They're eating the others. Uh, well, let's be nice. There aren't any screams. You don't have to worry. I'm killing the trolls. You? You can't kill the trolls. They killed all the guards. They'll kill you too. I can handle trolls. What's wrong with you? Have you lost your mind? Crazy? Me? Yes, maybe I am. Maybe I have imagined all of this. Maybe the other four are still alive. Perhaps I never saw the trolls come here. You could be right. The trolls didn't come in and tear the others apart. They didn't rip off limbs and chew the flesh from bone. That's horrible. They did it right in front of you? Then it is real. No, even Kenjin? Kendin? He's really dead? No, I must get out of here. Uh, do you want me to take you to the surface? No, the trolls will eat you. They will find you. And even if they don't, the other thing will. Okay, whatever. Goodbye. I will flee now. You will die so that I might live. Thank you. It's unlikely that will happen, but... Okay, Daylin, get out of the way, please. Now, well, it seems we have... I shall do as you ask. ...reached an impasse. Um, I'm going to need to unload some magic gear anyways, just to lighten my bags, so I'll be right back while I teleport back to town. Alright, and I'm back. The prisoner has gotten away, Dalen is no longer blocking his way, so we can get back to Luton. Looks like ugh, just some alcohol that's not really worth picking up. It looks like some of the trolls dropped. Well, the two trolls we were fighting in this room. And more alcohol that is not worth anything. Alright, so let's check here. Ah, magic bolts. And some gold. Alright, there's one more room in this little area here. And go ahead and take that down. Looks like there's an alchemist's apparatus here, so, and a troll shaman. So if we get in fast, he won't be able to cast any spells. Yep, and as soon as we start hitting him, and he just starts trying to cast spells, we should be able to knock his spells loose. Just like that. And down he comes can loot his apparatus for a potion. Awesome. I have a feeling I'll be needing those soon. Although the uh, Body Knox ring has been very helpful so far. Okay, so continuing on, as you can see from the map, this area is not so big, although it is trapped. Gast and a troll berserker, it looks like. Okay, these things are starting to hurt, so I'm gonna try and remove myself for a minute. And heal up. And it looks like Dalen has taken on a disease, so I am going to cast a spell, drop everything, and then once the music stops, I'll be able to cure Dalen's disease. I have removed disease, which is one of my paladin abilities, and he's all good. And there's a trap here with another Staff of Defense. That's awesome. That has a Ghostly Visage, which I've been using quite a bit, so... OK, 
Okay. I think there are a lot of locked things in here, so I'm just gonna knock. Yep. All three of those are were locked. Now they're not. Just grab their contents. Alright. Looks like they're loading me down with potions. Which is good. And then, oh, looks like is next. We should go down pretty quick with Daylin. Yep. And looks like about two or three hits each. And there we go. Okay, I want to see if any of these are trapped before I try and open them. And I did not grab that ten gold. Okay, I can't say for certain, but it's been a little time, and if they were trapped, if I could detect the traps, I should have seen them by now. And just as I open it, I notice that it is trapped. But I did make my save there, so I didn't take nearly as much damage as I could have. Alright, and we're getting in the home stretch for this floor. Looks like a couple more trolls. Okay, that one goes down, the young one goes down, and the third troll enters the fray. We'll dispatch him very quickly, I'm sure. out this uh, excursion here, and I believe that was the last troll in the area. So we have avenged all the archaeologists and cleared the way for their excursion, but really, what are they going to get themselves into? That prisoner said there were things down here that trolls were afraid of. Well, let's go find out what they are. Alright, Dalen is pretty beat up, too. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and give him a potion as I walk through a trap. Or I'm going to give it to myself accidentally, because it didn't look like it was handing it over, but we'll uh, patch him up with a healer kit. Okay, coming over here. A couple of crates. All right, and this here uh, prism blossom seed is a quest item that you need for body knock. Dalen's running off because he noticed an enemy in this area, but I don't want him going that far. So come back here. I shall do as you ask. And let's talk to this thing first, or we'll fight this minigon, which is a minotaur. Uh, construct. As you can see, it can stun you with one of its abilities. And thankfully, since I have two people, it's less likely that we'll uh, both get stunned and just one-shotted. All right. Uh, each of the minigons will drop at least an axe, so we'll take that because it's worth you know 15 gold or so. <clears throat> Alright. Kurth, Sukhas, Turth. Uh, what are you saying? I am the guardian of the first seal. None may pass. Uh, what is the first seal? It is the portal that stands behind me. Only the masters may pass through. I need to get through the portal. None may pass. 
I am one of the masters. Let me pass. You do not speak the masters' tongue. You are one of the slave races. You may not pass. But I have been sent by the masters. I am on an important mission and must have access to the door. You do not possess the creator's ring. Slaves who have been sent by the creators always have the ring of Gax. Okay. Well, I don't have that, so goodbye. Hmm. Well, there's this big area around here. I wonder if the ring of Gax is here. Uh, first, we'll have to deal with this Helm's Horror, which is a, another... Uh, well, actually, it's more like an animated suit of armor than it is a construct, I think. But they're treated as constructs, so... And the great thing about these is each one drops a suit of full plate and a great My sword. My pack is too heavy. And it is awkward. So happened to empty bags of holding, so we should be good on inventory space for a minute. At least for this first level. Uh, I'll probably have to go back to town after each of these levels, because I think there are three or four health per level. Alright, Kidu's armor, and Kidu's armor. Oh, okay. So, this is full plate with a plus one armor bonus, and it gives me damage resistance to piercing and slashing. Uh, I think I have a new set of heavy. armor that I'm going to wear. It is awkward! Hey keeps my armor class the same, but the white bone armor doesn't do anything special. So we'll just stick that right in here. So now every time that I'm hit with a slashing attack or a, what was it, piercing? The slashing or piercing attack, I will resist five of that damage. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and lay on hands on myself, get back a couple more hit points, and then we'll go through this door. And maybe I can stop running into every single trap I see. Okay, there's a small room here, so I want to do this first. And inside is a Minigon. And me and Dalen both... Uh, Saved, so neither of us got stunned. Down it goes. Um, once I learn the spell Detect Traps, which I think is a third level spell, I might make a Detect Traps wand. Uh, it's just helpful. Really, it's just a time saver, so that I don't have to heal up as much or wait for the traps to reveal themselves. Alright, give Dalen a potion this time maybe. Yep, there we go. Okay. And now we can tackle this door. Yep, saw a chest here. Um there's a couple of chests in here. I'm sure they're all locked, so I'll go ahead and knock. Uh, Dalen charged in, opened the door by himself, and immediately got stunned. So let's get in and try and distract the Minigon. Yeah. Alright, he recovered fairly quickly, so that was good. Paid back the Minigon, everything that it dealt him. my cloak uh, actually saved me some damage there uh, it was fire damage so it re my cloak reduced the amount of damage I took and again just walking into every trap okay yet another great axe and this one has a bar of iron uh, again because I took some of the crafting skills 
some enemies will drop certain items that you can use to craft other items. Um, really, again, it's probably not very useful. Uh, but uh, I could sell them for a bit of gold. Okay, and then I saw a Minigon wandering around over here, so... And what is that now? Five for five traps that I've just blindly wandered into? Okay, let's see. Do you have anything... Have your great axe. So we'll just store that in a small bag. Um, Dalen's pretty beat up, so I'm going to take this opportunity to go ahead and camp for a second, and I'll be right back. Alright, so rested up, spells refilled, uh, the ability to take more traps to the face. I am very suspect of this chest, but it's not glowing red yet, so open it. Yep. But we've been picking up some uh, good healing potions, so we can deal with that. Be a little careless. Okay, so I attack the Minigon. Dalen goes after the Helmed Horror that came after us, and then a Gargoyle appears out of these statues. I think the other two statues are also Gargoyles, so but we'll deal with what we have right now. Okay. Now, gargoyles are very much like their uh, mythological equivalent. They can turn into uh, statues and, uh, you know, pretend to be stone structures just so uh, they can ambush prey. Uh, every gargoyle drops a skull, but I'm only going to take one of them. I need one to make some magic items in this chapter, but I don't need many of them, and you can't turn them into uh, the wizard S for uh, as uh, enchanting reagents. So my pack is too heavy. It is awkward. That and then I want to stow this and that. Okay, and I should be good at hauling again. I think this axe is just gonna have to sit here, but I can bar of iron. Okay, and there is a small chest that's labeled large chest, but we'll open it. And here is the Golem Signet Ring, the Ring of Gax. So I can go back to the Golem now and pass by its seal, but first there was one more area that I want to clear out. And as you can see, there's a number of statues over here, which means there's probably gargoyles. So let's go through this first bit. I think both of these are gargoyles. Nope. I know a number of these are gargoyles. And there they are, four of them. For the oath guard! But Dalen and I both take care of them pretty quickly. Uh, again, my perception check has not been the greatest at detecting traps, so I'm pretty sure this is trapped. 
No, it's not. But there is breastplate plus one. My pack is too heavy. And that it is, is awkward. Cumbered me. So I'm gonna move some of these axes over into this bag, and then move this over. And I'm still encumbered. So I have to. Looks like go back to town, maybe, unless I can figure out a way to lose just a little bit of encumbrance. Okay, there we go. All right. And so I'm just going to try and uh, finish up this level real quick. I think there's only one more Minigon fight. And then between episodes, I will go back to town and sell off all the heavy useless stuff that I don't want. And we'll take these arrows. And let's talk to the golem again real quick. You may not pass. Yeah, but I found the ring. You may pass. And then we open the door! And immediately see a golem minotaur. Yeah! Daylight is stunned. Amazed yeah! by its mechanical workings. Yeah! <gasps> But that soon passes, and he comes over and beats it up with me. Uh, somehow this guy got past the gold. My pack is too heavy. It is awkward. We'll just ignore that for now. And then there's this chest, which again is probably trapped. Oh nope, the floor before the chest was trapped. And I stopped successfully. Right, and then we'll just move up here, and with that, I'm going to go ahead and call it an episode, so thanks for watching guys. Uh, like I said, between episodes, I will go back to town and sell off some of the stuff, uh, so yeah, join me next time when I uh, go deeper into the creator ruins. I believe there's three floors. Uh, maybe four, but if there is a fourth floor, it's like one room maybe, so, but again, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.